In this video, I will show you how to install Pandas in Jupyter Notebook and create a sample project in Jupyter Notebook that uses Pandas. So let's get started. Go to your project folder. I don't have a folder yet, so I'll just create a new folder. I'll call it Pandas Project. If you already have a project, go inside that folder. And here, we first need to create a virtual environment. So hold Shift and right click and click on Open PowerShell window here. If you have Open Command Prompt here, you can click on that also. And now type Python M E N V, and you can name your virtual environment anything here. I'll write pandas V N V. Just in a moment, this pandas V N V will be created. So if I do reload, as you can see, pandas V N V is created. Now what we need to do is we need to install pandas in this virtual environment, and we need to install IPY kernel in this virtual environment so that it can be used as our kernel in Jupyter Notebook. So to do that, first of all, very important step, don't skip this, you need to activate the virtual environment. So to do that, type whatever you have named your virtual environment, and then type scripts, and then type activate. You can hit tab to autocomplete, hit enter, and now as you can see, virtual environment is activated. And here we will install pandas. So the command is pip install pandas, and pandas installation will start. If in your case you cannot find pip or it says pip is not found you can check the first link in the description below and you will see how you can install pip so as you can see pandas is installed now we need to install appy kernel so to do that type pip install appy kernel that is k-e-r-n-e-l make sure you spell it correctly hit enter and appy kernel will be installed once appy kernel is installed we need to set it up so that can be used as the kernel so to do that type python m appy kernel install dash dash user dash dash name and here write any name that will be shown in Jupyter Notebook so we can write p a n d a s kernel and hit enter and as you can see our kernel is installed now go back to your Jupyter Notebook and hit ctrl r to reload and if you click on new here you will see pandas kernel is now visible so we can click on this and now in this notebook, we can import pandas and work with pandas. So let me write a sample code here. And so let's run this using control and enter. As you can see, we can see the output, we can see the shape, we can see data frames, and we have the description of the data frame. This is how you can install pandas in Jupyter Notebook and work with it. If you have any questions, let me know in the comments below.